Hey, what's going on, y'all? It's Brother D back with another video. Um, I wanna I wanna do a joint today on the Watch the Redskins immediately. I really need to make this video. Did anybody see this game today? Forty to sixteen. New York Giants trounced the Watch the Redskins in Landover, Maryland. That was pathetic. That was very, very pathetic. And I think that it's time for uh, Jay Gruden to go. He has to go. We, I mean, we were 6-3 at one point this season. And we just fell apart. We are falling apart. And ever since Alex Smith got hurt, our season is over. I mean, it, it's just pathetic the way that they just... They came out there and they just they quit. I don't want to hear no excuses today about the play. I understand we lost Alex Smith for the season, hurting his leg and Colt McCoy. But I mean, but you could have put more effort. I mean, it was ridiculous the way they played today. Today it was very very ridiculous that you go out there and you just get manhandled like that. And you got to put that on the defense. I understand we are no quarterback. But come on, man. That defense gave up 34 points in the first in the first half. I mean, it was very, very pathetic. That was pathetic. That was... And I've been a Redskins fan for 32 years. And it's just downright embarrassing to, to play like that, man. It's very, very embarrassing. You are a, a, and it's just not about, you know, it ain't about talent. It's about who won it, man. He had, what, Barkley, 159 yards in the first half. That That's not effort. At one point, the Washington Redskins had the best defense in the league at one point. And you telling me you give up 34 points in the first half. They quit. They flat out checked out. I mean, it, it's ridiculous. It is very, very ridiculous. I don't want to hear them excuses about, you know, we don't have a quarterback. Um, I don't want to hear excuses. It's, I mean, you know, I'm going to give y'all um, a reference from um, George Foreman. He always said that, he always said that, that it's better for a man to knock him out than to make him quit. We quit. We flat out quit today. We look like punks. They took off. They came in that game and they took our hearts from us. Playoffs is over. It's time for Jay Gruden to go. We got to get another, we got to get another coach. Because what have we done since he been to one playoff game in four years and we got bounced by the Green Bay Packers 2015. So my thing is, what's next for the Redskins? Because the next three games don't matter. I mean, it was pathetic the way we performed today. That you let, you put a team out there to, to play like that and just get this, they get manhandled, man. They didn't even have they didn't even have Odell Odell Beckham Jr. today. They didn't have OBJ today. So what's the excuse to get out there and get manhandled like that? They got manhandled. It's time for them to go. And I think guys didn't quit. They didn't quit. They quit. 34 points in the first quarter. 34 nothing. I understand we got a quarterback that we got we got a couple of quarterbacks off the street. But it's no sense. I gotta put this on the defense. The defense, I wouldn't even give them a paycheck today. I would not give them a paycheck today. Because that was pathetic, man. That was that was the worst. I have never seen a team look that bad. That was pathetic to come out there and look like. And this is a big game for us. Because we could have won this game. We still could have been in the hunt. 
in the NFC playoff race. Now we're out of the race now. We got Jacksonville next week. It, it, it does, to me, it doesn't matter, man. Our season is over. But to go out there, I understand players get hurt. I understand guys, been, the offensive line, you know, been hurt up. But for you to come out there, it's about effort, man. It's about heart. This ain't about coaching. This ain't about talent. It's about heart. What heart did the Redskins defense show up today? They quit. They will. They might as well not even play, man. You go out there and get embarrassed like that. That's embarrassing, man. These people pay all this money to go see these games. They, excuse me. They pay all this money to go see the New York Giants and watch the Redskins. I think the Washington Redskins should refund their money for the effort they played today. They played with no heart. They got their hearts taken out them. Come on, man. You made Eli Manning look like Joe Montana. Come on, man. Come on, man. You know, I know they don't rant like this, but it was purely, a, it was a joke. To, to perform that the way that defense played today. You give up 34 points in the first half. It's pathetic. And I think it's time for us as, you know, Redskin fans, I think that it's time to start looking at a quarterback to come out of college. Stop giving me all these old, washed-up quarterbacks. We need a real young quarterback. We need a young quarterback, and we need another coach. And I think we need some some deep. We need on the defensive. We need some help on the defensive side of the ball. We need a we need a pass rush, a real pass rusher. We got the two D D um defensive tackles in the middle. And Josh Norman, he has to go. Josh Norman has to go. He is old. He is washed up. I mean, I can say he washed up, but. He's not the player. We paid him a lot of money. And he's had a horrible year. Horrible. He has to go. I mean, it's time, man. It's time. I think it's time to clean house. We need to get out here and go get a real quarterback. Stop going out here getting these 33, 34-year-old quarterbacks. Stop, stop wasting our time and money. We got to pay... We gotta we gotta pay Alex Smith next year. And he might not even be playing. That could have been money we could have did something else with. And man, it's pathetic to look like that, man. I didn't even look at the second half. I looked at the Patriots and Dolphins game. Dolphins won. And then look at the Miami Dolphins. They ain't got all that much talent. But it's about heart. It's about will. Look at the Broncos. They've been hurt up all year. But they, they've been figuring out a way to win. That's what, that's what, I don't even, you know what the thing that bothers me though? The thing that bothers me, man, I know that we, and it, it, it hurts, man. It hurt. I'm sorry, y'all. But it hurts to see somebody just quit. To quit, man, it's okay to get knocked out. It's okay to get knocked down. But it's not okay to stay down. And we stay down. You know, it was pathetic. It was very, very, a weak, very, very pathetic performance, man. So, I mean, we got to, we got to, we got to, um, we got we to gotta get it together. Uh, man, I'm frustrated. Let me go ahead, man. I, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.